Hello and welcome back. We are here for the uh, our matchup against Southern Alberta Institute of Technology, the Trojans. Yeah. And honestly, this is going to be a rather intense matchup. Earlier, we were talking about how we went up against an SAIT team before. Yeah, it was their other Smash team. Yeah, it was their other t Smash team, but this yeah. one's supposed to be their better team, which is a little intimidating, but you know what? I Oh, another Palutena. Yeah. Uh, it's good that we warmed up against <laughs> a Palutena at Rigby. Um, <laughs> right? But um, we have Asda on the stage against uh, a Trojan Palutena here. Um, I'm kind of curious to see how this is going to turn out. I know, we're going to see a very different skill set. Mm -hmm. uh, especially uh, since you have to take into account that Southern this Southern Alberta uh, team, anyway, has gone undefeated, as have we. Mm -hmm. um, so this fight will be our two teams um, fighting for uh, first place C. Yeah. Uh, and it seems like right now as just getting kind of bodied. So um, up in 78, doing some okay damage on Palutena here. Um, but the, the damage war is still very much in Palutena's favor. Um, um, as is doing their best to try and close that gap. Um, but Palutena, uh, from what they have been able to do, has gotten some good hits on Azra there. Um, just some aggression that he wasn't really ready for. Um, so they're trying to make their comeback, in a sense, you know, coming back onto the stage, trying to do some additional damage. Palutena getting them up to 113, meanwhile, playing at 55%, now 63. Oh, and he the... Just, oh! He just needs to land those hits, and he makes significant damage on Palutena, taking away the first stock of the, uh, of the match. Honestly, at 128%, just taking it off when I think Pelotina was, I think, in the they 90s. Were at, so they were at 60. Whoa. And then they got they got hit by a, uh, a charge B, um, which brought them up to like 90 something and then took them out. Yikes. So, that's, you know, that's Azra's very good at like uh, timing those charge attacks really well. Um, we, we've seen he, we've seen him take off quite a few stocks like that in previous fights. Uh, but Palutena is able to find the extra oomph that they need to take out another stock or to take out a, a stock on Asda, um, leaving the score even for the meantime. It's two stocks across the board. Uh, but Asda is uh, definitely winning that damage board here, uh, just continuing uh, to go out on Palu finally finding uh, the kind of pacing and rhythm that they need for this fight um, to bring things in their favor. If he, um, gets, if he could get some more juggling in there, it'd be really in his favor. Mm. Um, you know, Pauly is up at 97. Meanwhile, Asda is only at 21. Um, so, as, you know, as we can see with this stock fight, they're definitely doing a bit better for uh, just... Uh, yeah, you know, kind of upping their defense and upping how fast they're going in uh, to uh, take fights. Um, some of these engages aren't happening very well in uh, Asa's favor here, uh, but it's still pretty okay. Uh, you know, oh. I'm able to find a teleport, uh, take one off of uh, Polly, and, uh, you know, bring in score up into the Vandal's favor once more. I can't help but to compare against Rigby. Mm -hmm. And I gotta say... So far, I think Rigby has a better Palutena. I mean, yeah, maybe. Like, just utilization of skills. But if any Southern Alberta students are watching, I, I don't want to admit that a high school has a better player than it. Okay. Probably. Honestly. But you know it is what it is. Age is not uh, what makes the player, but the experience. And if you don't got that experience, you aren't going to win these fights, or you aren't going to be able to do as much damage as you could have if you had more experience. And that's exactly what we're seeing uh, with uh, this fight here. You know, Azda is getting Palutena up into 89%, uh, playing with a pretty big damage gap, uh, playing with a good charge attack, trying to see if they can get Palutena off the ledge once more. The only difference between this Palutena and the other Palutena back at Rigby is that this one isn't constantly uh, self-destructing. So. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty much. Yeah. But that could be like uh, getting familiar with the recovery times. That is true. Or the teleportation distance. Mm -hmm. Because that's what's mostly been saving this Palutena is that teleportation. Mm -hmm. But as we can see, with 141% damage on Palutena, it's really close 
getting up that crimson. Oh, yeah. Wow. Finally taking off that final stock, uh, leaving the score in the Vandal's favor. Uh, I'm pretty sure we still had two stocks. No, we had one. We had one? Yeah. Oh, it's okay. 10 I can't see. I can't see. I can barely see it because the camera's actually pushed back. So even if I tilt like this, it's really annoying really to try and look past the camera and uh, look I just, for it. I just remember seeing the thing twice for Meta Knight. That's fair. Yeah. Um. So yeah, the score is now 10-9 in the Vandal's favor. Uh, the Trojans so far already have been able to put mm -hmm. up a really good fight against us, uh, which is uh, either a little concerning for us or maybe a little exciting for, you I mean, what? it's a little exciting for me personally, you know, I'm excited to see some tougher opponents, um, some tougher challenges and not just a uh, complete Wipe sweep. Out? Yeah. Yeah. So I agree with that. I'm kind of going to take Summer's approach to this and be like, if we see a challenge, it's a good thing. Yeah, exactly. We're, we're, we're here we're for something a lot more entertaining. We actually have even skill sets among yeah. our competitors here. And, uh, a sweep feels good, but it's not nearly as entertaining as a tough fight. And it's not really – like a sweep isn't as earned of a win, in my opinion. Given that, given that challenge, you're working but, for that win. But I feel like – it's definitely like one that's earned because well, I mean, you it's earned because you still played it and you developed that skill set to get that good. That's true. So yeah, I feel like it's still earned. It's just not nearly as entertaining. That's fair. Yeah, um, but eventually we will be moving on to uh, the Trojans' next competitor, which we do we don't not know, know anything who about who that them. is yet. We 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 have no idea. No, because uh, on their Twitch they play. Uh, they stream League and, I believe, Rocket League, I think. And nothing else. So that's pretty great. We have no information to provide you. No background info. I can't brag about their students. Yeah. But I can brag about our Vandals. <laughs> <laughs> Asda is a very impressive player. Honestly, even with one stock, I think he could at least take two. Two more. Could we shoot for two? Maybe. I I'm, I'm shooting for one. I'm trying to think uh, I'm trying to keep things calm here. Um and as we Ooh, see hero. we're going up against a hero player. Um I think I've only seen one hero player like ever and it was during stock trade. Yeah, stock um, trade was awesome. So Exhausting, but awesome. This is a new experience, I'm pretty sure. Uh one of the first hero players that we've seen in the league. Um so I'm, I'm kind of curious to see what we're about to go against. Uh, As is already going around looking for a fight. Hero is able to take off the first hit, uh, take the first hit. Um, but As uh, is, you know, still looking for some opportunities to shine, and they're finding that here, uh, getting a few good hits on Hero here. Um, Ooh, oh yeah. Lightning. We're, we're seeing Hero be a very heavy hitter. I'm not exactly too sure about their play style or how they work, um, but. Uh, be honest, this might be a little bit of my bias, but Hero feels just like a cheap system. Damn, go crazy. Well, I mean, like, yeah, there's some uh, similarities, but there we go. You know, we have Asda taking off stock on Hero pretty well, getting him off the stage, and that might be something that they want to capitalize on future stocks. You know, getting him off the stage seems to be um, where Hero isn't as strong. They're not able to uh, recover as well, or at least escape uh, from the patterns that Asda is able to put them in. Uh, which is why Azure has been able to do so oh. much damage on them, just like oh, those few attacks and the right recovery. there. And from oh. the, yeah, that's exactly what I'm saying. Uh, you know, as soon as they're off the stage, they aren't really able to get back on uh, as easily um, as Azo with normal util. Um, but you know, just with the normal skill set uh, in 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 mind. Um, oh. But with a with a good attack. Uh, Hero is able to take off Asda's final stock, leaving the score nine. No, they. It would have been. It would. It was ten nine. So now it's nine seven. Yes. Yes, I know math. But you know what? What I said. <laughs> two stocks. Hero yeah, that's true. You, yeah, you did take <laughs> off two. two yeah, stocks. you were able to do that. So I, um, I know the Vandals well. I know the Vandals well, yeah. and it looks like we're going into the next match with 
uh, full stocks against their one stock. Oh. And they're and putting Hunter's, in Hunter. Hunter is <laughs> on the table here. It looks like Shiny Shoes is going to be our last. Oh, wait. No, we still have Candy. So Candy Candy's might. not here. Oh, right. I keep forgetting that. So I don't remember. Isn't it uh, not Yoshi that's here? Yes. Not Yoshi. Here. So it might be either not Yoshi or um. Well, I don't Shiny think not Yoshi is on the varsity team. No, but I think they're subbing in. Well, if they're not candy. on the varsity team, they're not on the roster. I think they might be a sub. But if she's on the JV team, then... I have no idea how okay. this is working. Me neither. Unless if Angelo's going to play. Because that, that that's what I'm expecting at this point. That would be sick. That would, oh, that would be oh sick. Oh, God. But We're not, uh, no one's ready for that, I don't For think. SAIT, don't take what we say seriously about the roster because we have no idea. None. Well, I do know that I do know that um, Elliot is on the uh, JV team. Well, okay. Yeah, and so like the way I'm, I'm pretty sure the way that it's set up is that you have to be registered on that team's roster in order to sub, but you, like on that specific team. So if you're on a JV team, but not on the varsity team, and you sub for a varsity player, that's an illegal sub. Well, can't you be JV and on the varsity? No. Oh, then I have no idea what's going on. Yeah. But uh, anyways, uh, Hunter's here, and so is Hero, and Hero has lost two stocks. And uh, I'm sure that Hunter is going to finish this fight off very quickly. Oh, yeah. Um, you know, we, we see Hunter uh, being able to play very aggressive, uh, very, very, very fast, and uh, get some good damage out on their opponents like this uh, right here, finding... Uh, grab and then leading up to a few up specials and uh, air combos. Uh, you know, always nice to see. It's kind of uh, what makes uh, Hunter look very fun to play. Um, or make Falcon uh, very fun to play. Um, I was going to say that move is sick. Yeah. I think from uh, a time that I remember casting with Diggs, I think the way that those abilities work is that um, Hero has a set number of abilities that randomly generate every time he opens that menu. Um, and they're, uh, they're able to uh, pick from one and use it. And I think that, uh, I think MP stands for mana points and it judges yeah. how and often they can get those abilities. Uh, so I know how MP works, at uh -huh. least, because that's typically the type of game I play. Mm -hmm. um, oh, nice move by uh, Hunter. Just yeah. takes out his last lock. But anyway, how MP works. You have all those skills, right? Mm -hmm. Each of them have their own like MP cost. Mm -hmm. So you can only do a set amount of them for however much MP you have. Mm -hmm. So say he did the lightning strike, but it took a majority of his um, mana. Mana. Yeah. Then he would have to wait for a certain amount of time before getting another a l another lightning attack if he wanted to do another one. But mm. if he still had a little bit left, he could do one of the smaller ones, like mm. maybe a minor heal or that acce uh, accelerate one that he was using. Mm. Uh, it's like a haste, and it doesn't take that much mana. Mm. Uh, he might have done the fire slash. I saw a crackle, which was probably the lightning one. He could do a shield. Mm. Um, I saw a few more, but it's blocked mostly by the camera. So. Yeah. Love but the setup. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, great. We're going to fix it eventually. I I'm, I'm, camera, I'm sure. We um, looked a lot better than we did uh, earlier in the semester. <laughs> I will true. say that. Yeah. Uh, we are going to see Hunter going in with two stocks against a three stock. It is now six to nine no sorry six to eight so it's a two stock difference pretty close still mm -hmm. uh southern alberta can catch up rather yeah. easily at this point uh -huh. they uh, we've been seeing some tougher competition from them able to keep the balance of the fight um very very close um so you know i'm, I'm interested in to see uh where things go from here we don't know who's getting moved in yet um at least from southern alberta's side uh, seems like Things are happening in the lab that I can't see. Can we have some confirmation on who's uh, subbing in for Candy? But um, anyway, in the meantime, I really hope that we do a Hollow Bastion stage because I want to see it. But that's just me, <laughs> obviously. Because of course we're going to do Small Battlefield again because that's all we've been doing. I'm okay. I'm not tired of seeing the, sta the same stage over and over and over again. 
feels like st uh, the stock trade all over again. No. <laughs> Just PS2, 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 PS2. Oh, no, they picked PS1. Oh, oh. it's PS2 again. <laughs> <laughs> and we're going for Small Battlefield. Wow. So much fun. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it's a classic. It, it can't go wrong. Uh, you if can't. it's not this, <laughs> it's, it's like PS2. It's like hearing your favorite song over and over again until you get sick of it. I personally don't usually experience that, but I can't get... Oh! We're seeing a Cal uh, Falcon Falco player. going against Captain Falcon. I always found that amusing. Yeah. If only Candy were here. <laughs> we can see that Falcon ditto. With pink helmet. Yeah. Pink Captain Falcon. I love that. Yeah. Taking off that first spot for Falco. Okay, so from what I understand, usually there's a button check, and if they, if there is no button check, both players will do a taunt to confirm that they're ready to start the fight. I'm pretty sure is how that works. Yeah, that would make sense. That's what they've been doing. Yeah, but anyways, uh, that, that it seems makes like things a lot more clear. Yeah, <laughs> for us. Uh huh. Um, but Hunter has uh, gotten some good damage out on Falcon there. And, uh, you know, likewise, from the opposite side, you know, Falcon or Falco is at 76. Meanwhile, Falcon is playing at 59. It's going to be a tongue twister saying those two names uh, over and over again. Um, but, you know, Falcon, Hunter. Fal Hunter is uh, going back uh, and getting some very good damage out on Ooh. Falcon there. Um, and uh, we're, oh, yeah, nice little down, uh, down tilt there. Uh, oh, oh. Uh, trying to look for an under stage stock there. Um, not really finding it, but it's okay. Still getting some decent damage out on Falcon there. Uh, and from a failed recovery, taking out Falcon's first stock. Um, yeah, it's uh, it's not going great for Falcon here. Uh, but it's okay. You know, they're still putting up a good fight. They've been able to uh, get out some good damage out on Hunter. Um, but Hunter is uh, built different, as the children say. Uh, <laughs> I, 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 I like pretending to be an old man. Um, it, it helps me cope. <laughs> cope with your age. Cope with my cope with my babiness. I'm the youngest person in the lab. Oh yeah, you are. Yeah. Man, that feels weird for me. I'm used to being the youngest. <laughs> In any situation. Oh, Hunter is uh, has been finding some good damage this stock. Uh, getting Falcon up to 120. Uh, nope, nope. Uh, 138, looks like. Um, you know, they were able to get them up and then uh, use their gun to uh, get some extra damage down on them, which was pretty fun. Um, but uh, Hunter is on his last stock here um, at 99%. So if Falcon is able to find the damage that he's looking for, he could be able to take out another one of our players. Uh, you know, they are able to find a crit, but that doesn't always mean mm. at the end. That does, though. Um, yeah. Yeah, that was... Uh, that I was love seeing that. Yeah. Actually, I'm sorry that it was on one of our players, mm. but it's just such a strategic move that's so risky mm. for all parts. Whenever I see it, I'm just like, that's some yeah. confidence for you right I've, there. As, <laughs> I, as I've heard uh, from Aiden, our production staff, there is nothing more satisfying in this game than landing a down spot. <laughs> <laughs> and he just confirmed that for yeah. us. <laughs> we are heading into the next match. It's going to be a 6-5 to five game. That is where we're at right now. That's how close we are. Yeah. That's that's. Although we are going in with wow. a uh, fresh player with all four stocks, and it's Shiny, shiny is taking the stage. Um, so do you think that means that it is, in fact, um, the captain? The I would the be coach. very surprised. I would be, be very surprised if that's what ends up happening here. That's um, so scary. He's actually a really good player. Or yeah. maybe it's Vulcan. Vulcan's on the varsity team, isn't he? Vulcan is also on the JV, JV team. Unofficially, oh. technically, but I mean, they're on the JV roster from okay. the, what I last saw. Then who is it? I still haven't gotten any inf We still haven't gotten any information. Hey, Angelo. Who's filling in for Candy? Who's filling in for Candy? Oh, yeah, oh. Dive. Oh. Hey, I was right. It could have been not Yoshi. Oh, I don't know that. 
But I forgot. But I forgot, I forgot Dipe, Dipe was, was here. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Dipe. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I forgot. Dipe is the Falcon player that I was talking about. It's not Candy. Yeah, Candy is uh, Byleth. Yeah. Yeah, I'm so smart, guys. I remember what our players play, even though I've been casting them all season. I know, right? Yeah. It's, oh. it's great. Can we please do Hall of Ashton? <laughs> Please. They're just going to keep picking small battlefield. I know. It's the visual buff, maybe. I mean, it's technically <laughs> winner's pick, I'm pretty sure, is how this works. Is it? Maybe. I don't know. Or is it host pick? I think it's winner pick. Oh, okay. I don't know. Can they pick Hall of Bastion, then? <laughs> <laughs> I don't care who does it. it. It would just please my little nerdy heart. But going into our next match against Rosalina... Uh, Captain Falcon against oh Rosalina. Boy. They're hovering oh. over a certain area, which means I feel like I know what it's going to be. The Pokemon League isn't too oh. bad. Still not That what wasn't I want. what I was expecting, but hey, it's not small battlefield, so finally something else to look at. It's a win. <laughs> yeah. Uh, going up against Rosalina and Captain Falcon, that's going to be an interesting matchup. Rosalina is not as fast as Cal Captain Falcon. Let's yeah, I know you are. Not no, really. no. But uh, with not. Shiny's playstyle, they are very, very aggressive. They, they can put out some very uh, powerful hits. Yeah, can rack up that damage real fast. Yeah. And just how floaty the character is and how well Shiny Shoes knows how much Rosalina can move, how much she can take. It's... I am in favor of Rosalina. I would hope so. Oh, I mean, <laughs> like, prediction-wise, it's in favor of Rosalina. Mm, but I Captain see. Falcon will put up a fierce fight. That's that's what I'm thinking right now. I He's do still like Pink Falcon. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think I've ever seen Pink Falcon. Me neither. So, uh, it's yeah, pretty it's great. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, wait a minute. Is Octopus the best with the answer to this one? I was going to make I a joke about Breast Cancer Awareness Month, but I think it's already passed, because I think it's October. Aiden, do you know? <laughs> I was just asking Siri. Oh, Damn no, it. You were right, it was I October. Was there. Yeah. I, uh, I had football family, and high school football is really about Breast Cancer Awareness Month for some reason. Yeah, I was small town. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah, we know. You see them bring out at the pink least, socks and the pink armbands. And I know at least like five people that had cancer. Huh? One of which was breast cancer. Huh? Most of them survived. <laughs> anyway. Any yeah, no, anyways, uh, we're like uh, <laughs> mid-fight now, so uh, I think that we should get to that. Um, it, it seems like the war is currently being won. Did I think all of them survived. <laughs> I, I think that the war is being won by Falcon here. Um, kind of. Uh, no, it's being won by uh, Shiny. Just by yeah. a little bit. Uh, you know, both players are definitely on even playing field. And, and now it, now they're that not. That Falcon kick was yeah. insane. Yeah, uh, they're looking for an opportunity here uh, to uh this stock trade. And doing so. Uh, without taking any damage, which is uh, pretty good. Even damage, stock trade advantage for us. Uh, I I'm like it. I'm pretty sure it's still. Wait, is Falcon playing on the stock? Yeah. He oh. lost the stock last match. Oh, yeah. So um, the uh, the stock advantage is, yeah, in our favor. But the um, damage advantage. But the, yeah, it's in Falcon's favor. You know, they're able to get up and uh, just, just do a lot in a very short amount of time, which is. Uh, Obviously something that you can do with Falcon's play style, but um, definitely uh, rough to see on Shiny here. Um, Shiny is doing their best to do uh, as much damage as they can, as they're doing like pretty good job there. Uh, you know, getting a nice small little combo, getting Falcon up to 59%, meanwhile playing at 84. Um, obviously the, uh, the stock advantage is still uh, in Falcon's favor, which is probably why they're upping the ante. Uh, in terms of aggressiveness and uh, playing to get more damage out. Uh, the goal is always about stocks. Mm -hmm. It's not about winning every battle, but you know, the more damage that they're able to do to our points, the better. Um, but obviously, same goes from this perspective, uh, which is kind of what we're seeing now. 
seeing as uh, Falcon is in a somewhat high damage oh. percentage, this still is a dangerous fight for them to play, uh, even though uh, Shiny is playing with uh, one more stock here. But... Uh, uh, Shiny is no longer playing with one, one yeah. stock. Yeah, they are. No, they're not. Shiny is playing with one stock. Oh, I thought you said one more stock. No. Yeah, they have one last stock. Okay. Yeah. Sorry, miscommunication here. Yeah, it's, it's fair. Sometimes my words do not word. Nah, sometimes my ears don't hear. <laughs> <laughs> but here we are. Falcon is at 155, while Rosalina is at 10%. Uh, so it's definitely in our favor, but he def... Uh, sorry, Falcon definitely puts on some serious damage. Until Rosalina takes over and an up smash or an up tilt? I'm pretty sure it was an up smash. Tilt. It was a tilt? Yeah. Oh, I guess okay. that makes sense. I'm learning the mechanics. Yeah. We're doing great. I could do like character analysis and like stuff like that, but ask me the specific movements. I usually get it wrong, but I mm. got it right that time. Yay. Yeah. But uh, I don't remember what the score is, but I still know it's in the Vandal's favor. It is now... Uh. Four to three. We lost two stocks. They lost. Right. They're on the Candy, uh, sma uh, Shiny is on their last stock, right? Mm -hmm. Still very, very close. Yeah, extremely. Yeah. This is going to be a little intense. I'm fine if we do Pokemon League again. Just please not, not small battlefield. Maybe Hall of Bastion. Please. Oh... <laughs> 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 uh. Uh, it's 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 getting to that time where my brain isn't braining and I can't word. Do you want me to take over play by play? Um, no, I I think I think I'm doing fine. I might have you take over for a bit. Uh, the next game. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, because it's two out of three, isn't it? Yeah, best out of three. So we have another one of these to do, and it's very very close. So uh, we're seeing Southern Alberta bring out their last player here. Uh, I'm not exactly best. sure who it is. Probably their MVP. Maybe. I mean, if they're strategizing. Well, honestly, I I if you if you kind of thinking about it this way, it's like understanding that both of these teams have gone undefeated the entire season. Saving their best player might not be the same good strategy as it was for the other teams. Um that's fair. Because admittedly, I mean, like, we also swept through all of the other teams, and it wasn't really close. That's true, but... So their I best mean, player against these other teams might not be their best player against these better players. But who is to say? Who is to say? We still have... I mean, have we were trying to keep some of our players hidden in the case of... We have PS2. Whoa! PS2! Yay. It's it's not small battlefield. It's so, not um, small battlefield. And, and plus, PS2 is a fun map. It's a fun map to look at. Um, it's mm. a giant stage with a Pokemon ball on it. Yeah, but like, look at the background. It's <laughs> fun. It's fun. It's a fun background. It looks like we're going up against a Falco player. It's gonna be a button check, so yeah. don't expect anything. <laughs> yeah. I remember at, at the end of the button check, um, both players will do a taunt to. Let the other player know that they're good. Um, and then we also got to wait for uh, Shiny to take off a couple of their own stocks as well, because remember, they're mm -hmm. only playing with one stock. So, uh, But they might just decide to just... Actually, no, I guess it wouldn't, they wouldn't do that. But I thought for the time part, they... I think they have to, it's a 30-second button check. Yeah, no, they're no, going to... They're resetting. Yeah, okay. I thought because of time. Yeah. So it looks like we're going to head to no the No way, guys! This is the end! No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Yay! We are still pretty close. This is Southern Alberta's final fighter. Uh, that seems like they also have a Falco player here, which is uh, pretty interesting. Maybe we can see how they compare to our Falco player next next match. Yeah. I would love to see two Falcos play. Yeah, I would love to see the it Falco It would be confusing, ditto. like watching a DKVDK match. Well, you know what? Yeah. Oh I'm here my for God, it. that was the um the Newman, that uh -huh. was the Newman game, yeah, where we just saw dittos over and over. Yeah. In the stock trade. Oh my gosh, the stock oh trade. Yeah. Okay, those are the two oh stocks. God, don't remind me. 
<laughs> oh, this is stressful. Just take on at least one. I believe in you. I believe in you. Yeah. And it seems like uh, Shiny was able to make the first engage here, um, getting uh, the first bits of damage on Falco here. Uh, making sure to keep their distance and uh, get some good damage on them. But Falco is still able to get in, uh, get a few hits on Shiny there, trying to balance out the damage a little bit more. Um, nice yeah, recovery I, I was, from Rosalina. Whoa. Nice recovery from both. I was kind of scared that Rosalina was going to lose a stock there. Um, but, uh, you know, oh, it seems like he's doing relatively okay. Um, the 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 damage war is still being won by Falco here, um, and uh, Shiny is playing in a bit more dangerous territory. Obviously, playing on their final stock. Um, and with Falco being such a heavy hitter, it is certainly dangerous to like play on that uh, off stage battles. And, oh, and that's what I meant. All right, Falco so, has uh, a lot of moves that would just end you off stage. Uh huh. But uh, now we are off to our last two fighters. And it is 3-3. Three, three. And it's 3-3, three, three, yeah. These are our very, very last fighters from both teams here. Whoever wins this fight determines who takes the first point of the series. Mm -hmm. um, I'm not sure who we're putting in yet. It's either going to be Dipe. Um, I think it's going to be Dipe. Or it's going to be Night Ishi. But uh, it's probably now we're about dipe. to find out as we are going into character select. Dipe. Yeah, you were right. Yeah. And we're going to see Captain Falcon. Yeah. <laughs> going for the... We could do a Falco v. Falco, and then a, a Captain Falcon, Falcon v. Falcon. Falcon. <laughs> yeah. So I'm That's interested to see what happens with that um, next game, but uh, I'm not sure. Yeah. Hollow Bastion, Hollow Bastion, Hollow Bastion. But they get a pick, I think. Yeah. Oh, I'm. That's okay. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> it's like edging. Yeah, back to. I would have uh, been fine with Coliseum too. Okay, that place fine. is pretty cool. Yeah. And yeah, oh, a message, all right. greetings. Oh, they're still selecting their player. I, I, okay. Well, they shouldn't be. It's the same person. I think they're just. Pausing for a moment? Yeah, I don't know. Possibly. Shrug. C can we hurry it up a little bit? <laughs> <laughs> I want to get through this last stressful uh, matchup to mm -hmm. get into the next game. Yeah. And now, um, this is a bit unlike the first fighters that you come up with. Uh, having a matchup like this is a second opportunity for both teams to reassess how the game is going to go and you know, what their fighters have to bring to the table um, and what kind of stakes are being put on the table here. Let's go, Dipe. In the chat, send support for Dipe. Yeah. Gonna we wish we could uh, see chat, but today we cannot because we're just having a day. <laughs> it's definitely a day. Yeah, but um, Falco, is, or Falco is going in first with the first bits of damage, but Falcon is still winning the damage war here. Um, uh, trying to widen that gap a little bit more. Uh, play a bit defensively, which uh, is turning out too well so far as Falco is able to get uh, in and get some good damage oh. out on Falcon here. Nice throw by Falco. Oh! That, is that was dirty. Exactly what I was mentioning, that more defensive play style wasn't really being put in uh, Falco's or Falcon? Falcon's play style. I'm can't brain and word. Then we'll just call him Dipe. Dipe and Falcon. Uh, yeah, I don't know why I switched to Falcon, but um, yeah, that's that's what's going on. And uh, you know, Dipe is able to find that uh, up special there, uh, get some damage out on. Uh, oh. oh, finding another one, getting some extra damage out on Falco here, um, getting them up to 87. Meanwhile, playing at 57. Uh, you know, taking some more damage from the Falco player here. Oh my god, and it's just, it is, oh god, oh that god. recovery, but, uh, this is not looking good for us, but no. you know what, Fal uh, Falco is pretty high in percentage there, but that, oh They are no. still playing at full socks, though, yeah. which is um, 
it's it's definitely stressful for both players if you think about oh. it. Now Dive is able to find that really good up special, but Falco is still playing with three stocks, you remember. Um, so it's uh, it's stressful uh, to be in Dive's position right now. It's also stressful to be in Falco's position. He just lost their first stock of the fight. The um, score at the moment is, is one two. two. In in Jordan's favor, which is uh, the first time we'll ever we'll ever say that uh, the game is in uh, the opponent's favor. It's really not like that. But uh, Falco is just dirty. Uh, Falco just just goes off, goes for the extra off stage attacks, and uh, finishes off Dipe taking the first point of the series there. Yikes. Yeah. That's what I was saying earlier when uh, Hunter was playing. Mm -hmm. Once Falco Falco gets you in the air, that juggling, those moves are just so insanely damaging. Mm -hmm. It's it's no competition. Get him off stage, high chance of no recovery. Mm -hmm. But um, that was painful. Yeah, that was uh that was the first team to take a game off of us. So definitely yeah. a bit tougher competition. Uh, I'm not sure if we're going to be taking a break after this or if we're just going to be running into the next... Uh, I, th I think we're going to go right into the next one. I thought we were going Rainbow Cruise. That would have been interesting. Oh. Are they going to change it? But, um... Are we going into a break? I think we should just call our own. No, they're picking. They're picking already. Okay, so or well, they're not PS2. picking who's on yet, so we don't know. We're kind of just waiting around and figuring out what's going to happen next. Honestly, I would just assume that we're going to go on break and um, just come back in a minute or so mm -hmm. um, when they've got more stuff figured out. And honestly, you know, I could use a break. I need another water. So uh, we will be right back. Please yes. be sure to stay tuned. Get yourself a snack and some water. And, and stay um, warm. Yeah, for uh, those of you in our region, and we will see you back here in a few minutes. <laughs> 